In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Sodium Extra for Minecraft Java version 1.21.9. So, let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here, just go to your search bar and search up mod rent, like so. Now, enter. And here you'll find modernf.com, click on modernf, and this will bring you to the modernf homepage. From there, just go to the top of the website to discover content, then go down to mods. Now, go to search mods and search up sodium extra, like so. Now, simply go ahead and click on the mod's name, like so, and this will bring you to this page. From there, simply go to the versions tab, which is right here, and then you will find all the versions for Sodium Extra. So, what you want to do is simply go ahead and go to game versions and choose 1.21.9, and here you will find a release for 1.21.9 Fabric. So, what you want to do is click the download button, which becomes green when you hover over it, and click on it. So, here, you now have Sodium Extra. So, what you need to do is simply go to the version name of Sodium Extra. And this brings you here. What you need is Sodium for Sodium Extra to work. So, the way this works is that you see that we have a dependency. This is Sodium. This is iOS shaders if you want shaders for Minecraft. And this is Reese's Sodium Options if you want some more options for Sodium. So, the idea here is to get sodium as it's required. So simply click on sodium here, and this will bring you to this page. From there, simply go ahead and go to the versions tab, and this will bring you here, and now just go to game versions, and choose 1.20.9. Here, you will find all release for 1.20.9 fabric and quilt, but also fabric. So simply go ahead and click on the green dollar button. And now you're done with modern you can add iris shaders if you wanted to get shaders for sodium to work as well with shaders and whatnot. But in this case, we'll just get sodium extra and sodium. Okay, so what you want to do now is get yourself fabric. To get fabric, you simply want to go to a new tab. You want to go to your search bar and search up fabric Minecraft. Now you want to enter and then you will find fabricmc.net. Just click on fabric and this will bring you to the fabric homepage. From there, just go to the blue download button, and then go to the blue download for Windows button. And now you have the fabric installer. So once you have all the, of these files here, what you want to do is close or minimize your web browser. I will close mine, so like so. And now you can go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. And now, you will see that we have Fabric Installer, Sodium Fabric, and Sodium Extra. So, what you want to do is double click the Fabric Installer. This will like show up with a little installer like this. Make sure the Minecraft version is correct. And if it is, click Install. Then OK. Then Close. Once you did this, go to the Minecraft Launcher. With the Minecraft Launcher, you will be able to go ahead and add the two mods to the mods folder, which, if you see that we have fabric loader here, means that you have a mods folder created for you that you can access by going to installations, fabric loader, and then going to the folder icon. And then you will find that we have a mods folder. So here, just double click it. You should be in this, in .mark of mods, and from there, just go to your downloads folder, select the two mods and copy them, then go to the top left arrow to go back to the PS folder, and click paste. Here we copy pasted sodium and sodium extra in .minecraft mods. Once you have this, go back to the Minecraft launcher, go to play, make sure fabric loader is selected, and click play. And now you have to wait for Minecraft to open up automatically. Okay, so once you have Minecraft, you can go to a single player world, a server, or a realm. I'll just go to a single player world here real quick, and then you can see the new settings you have. So basically, here is Minecraft, 
and if you want to see that sodium is burning you can either do f3 this will just show you some like features of the game and your fps count so you can see that your fps count should normally be higher because of sodium but what you can do is just go ahead and go to your settings so options video settings and here you have so many settings it goes under this so here's all the settings you can change this is web sodium extra it gives you a bunch of extra features for you to change well one feature i love is reduced resolution on mac os this is actually really cool because if you're using like a like macbook or something you can just turn this on it just halves the resolution and you get like two times more fps so this is like literally free fps button but like here you can see that we have a lot of features that you can indeed change if you want to and that's why we have sodium extra here just because it just actually gives you all these features on top of the default sodium features so yeah that is how we download and install sodium extra for minecraft java version 1.21.9 so if you like this video make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one bye